We now turn to COVID-19 situation. South Korea's overall new caseload has been dipping, but it's too early to call it a downward. And with the cases still in four digits, the number of deaths and critically ill patients are growing. For more on this, we have our Kim Doyan at the News Center. So Doyan, what can we expect today? Tommy, South Korea's daily COVID-19 caseload for Friday is expected to be in the 1800s. From midnight to 9 p.m. Korea time Thursday, newly confirmed cases stood 1,682. And usually over the next three hours, the number of cases rises by around 100. This is a dip of 52 cases from 24 hours before and down 88 from last week's number for the same period. Two-thirds were from the capital region, where the population is the most dense in the country, indicating the threat of sudden surge at any time if a major cluster sprouts up. Friday's number would be the 52nd consecutive day with a four-figure daily caseload. One thing to note is the rise in the number of critically ill patients. At the moment, the authorities said 420 were in a severe condition as of midnight Thursday. That's a three-fold jump from early last month when the fourth wave began.